Hello, welcome back. Today I'm going to talk about uh, burning. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see it or not, but I burnt myself in two fingers today. I accidentally touched a heat shield on the mower. I want to talk about how to prevent and uh, try to te teach you how to uh, guess not medicate but uh, first aid like um, well first of all don't do that don't touch a heat shield I apologize for the shaking um, <laughs> it's a nice day here in Walkersville uh, very sunny out I think it's like 30 something 30 80 some degrees out um, Hope you guys are having a great day, first of all. Thank you for watching the video. Uh, like I said, first of all, don't do that. Uh, second of all, if you guys ever get a burn, um, run cool water over it for about 10 to 15 minutes to cool the skin down. A little, a little less than I learned this morning before I did this video. Um, between one and third degree burns. One degree burns are pink and I think pink and uh, discolored and sore. Second degree burns is that. <laughs> Blistered, sore. And third degree burns, well, it's as bad as it gets. It's uh, from what I've seen the, on the video I watched today. It was uh, skin already burnt off, uh, charcoal, charcoal skin. Um, I hope that never happens to anybody. I'm sure it has every day, somewhere in the world, I'm sure. But uh, I want to say, if for some odd reason where you do get a third degree burn, try to get some kind of cooled water. If you can, 10 to 15 minutes to cool the skin down. Lightly wrap it with gauze. The, over the years, they had debate um, different medications in the wrap, then wrap, then medications afterwards. Or uh, I, I say medication, then wrap, then to the hospital, urgent care wherever if you don't have that that stuff then improvise t-shirt make sure it's clean if possible uh, if you have a rag hanging around somewhere uh, number one key make sure it's clean cool the skin down first um, if you have second degree burn like this um, same principle cool it down with cool running water then me personally I put aloe on mine and then I bandaged it up put bandaid on it and went back to work stupidly enough I did um, I mean it'd been fine it's gonna heal as long as I don't pick the blister <laughs> I, I really want to I really want to pick this blister right now uh, but uh, don't don't ever put ice. Don't put butter. Um, I heard once put mayonnaise. Uh, don't 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 do that. For one, ice is going to do a false bite job, which is going to ruin your skin, it's going to ruin your nerves. Butter, that's just messy and just disgusting. And mayonnaise, nah. Um. But uh, for this second degree burn, depending how big it is, put uh, aloe on it, wrap it up. If you want to get it urgent care, get it urgent care. Um, I'm not telling you what to do. For me personally, depending how big the burn is, I would go. Uh, so this ain't too bad for me. Um, that's about it. Um, it's a short short sweet video hope you guys like it 
Uh, please stay tuned for next videos coming up. Uh, summer's out, household projects, or household protection. Uh, hope you guys like the video. Please subscribe, like, share, do your thing. You know what you gotta do. Um, peace out. Down in the description, I will have two links where you guys can watch a video about first aid to treat medical burnings.